Hello friends. It is another day of me researching the man question. In the last few videos, I talked about how to be a real man, and then I talked about men's living spaces. But this time we will be observing the male dating strategy. Oh dating boy. is hard nowadays. There is a reason people like Andrew Tate and these other red pill guys are blowing up right now. Men are confused. Men are lost. They're being told all these contradictory things on how to get women. Be nice, but not too nice. Don't oh god. If oh man. You you don't need a dating strategy in order to learn like the second you're looking for a strategy, you've already lost, all right? No strategy online is gonna help you with that. Oh. Don't show emotions. Show your emotions. Ma Date maxing. Yeah, we're treating this like a video game. It's like, subscribe to this random dude on the internet who is a level 99 at dating. He will know how to, you know, speed level you in, in this art that you lack in. Like, oh no. Make six figures, have a six pack, drive six Bugattis. Never I mean, having having money is definitely a thing, all right? I'll give I'll give them that, all right? Having six Bugattis can't hurt your case, all right? Or smile. Don't wipe your ass. In the animal kingdom. Oh yeah, make sure not to wipe your your butt. That's really going to help. Yeah. I've I've heard that, you know, that that's a top secret among the the guys that are best at dating a lot. Uh, yeah. The male will maybe show off its beautiful feathers or do a little dance to attract a mate. In the human world, a man will slide into a woman's DMs and ask for pictures of her toes. Oh, no, no, no. As a, as a girl on the internet, more often than not, they do the tried and true send their peepee in without even sometimes a hello or how are you. Peepee -pee first and then how's the weather later is, I thought, the tried and true internet method. I think she might be wrong here. So today, we are going to be reading some of those messages. But before we do that, let's quickly get into today's sponsor, because your girl can't make any jokes on this website without getting demonetized, <laughs> so... Yeah, you can't- I can't even say swear words half the time. Half of my, uh, YouTube content gets, like, limited monetization just because I- I have a sailor language too often, and YouTube does it like that. Are you tired of this happening to you? Introducing Displayed. Displayed specializes turning your current nerdy hyperfixation into high quality metal signs. Displayed features unique and beautiful artwork from hundreds of different movies, TV shows, video games, and even your favorite animes like Cyberpunk Edge Racers and Cowboy Boop Bop. You guys like Cowboy, Cowboy Boop, Bop. Boop Bop, right? We love that. I got myself this cool Mandalorian poster, this Star Wars poster from my nice. favorite episode, and this handy chart of tits. Who doesn't like tits? But the best part now is you how got their easy attention. they are to mount on the wall. Just place the sticker on the wall, place the magnet on the sticker, and place the display on the magnet. And you're ready to go. No power tools required. So click the link down I below love to get to your mount my tits at a special on the wall. discount that will automatically be applied at checkout. Big thank you to Display for sponsoring this video and thank you, the viewer, for not skipping the ad. Let's go. Uh oh. Now let's just address this incel word for a second. Oh god, not those. Once I tried asking a girl out, she cried and ran away calling me a creep. Self call out post, I guess. Is that what you tell everybody when when the topic comes up? I would I would recommend not. <laughs> Incel means involuntary celibate, usually referring to a man who cannot get laid. Usually I actually did not know that's what incel stood for. That it was a short term shorthand term for okay, I'm learning use as a pejorative, as an insult. Because everyone knows a man's worth comes from the amount of times his genitals have been inside a woman. Now there are two types of incels. There are the capital I incels, the incel movement, the one that just absolutely despises women. But then there's the lowercase i incels, the guys who just kind of have trouble dating for whatever reason. The word incel has absolutely lost any and all meaning. Like I don't think so. I just think that it becomes more normalized for people to be online and feel socially awkward or lonely. You gotta remember, not that long ago, people thought like World of Warcraft, like people who played that game were like satanic, you know? 
Like, we really villainized, like, gamers in general, and now gaming is a lot more popular, and that general stigma around all of that, uh, is gone. And, like, mental illness is not as stigmatized nearly as much as it used to be, so, I, I mean... That's my opinion. Like most words on the internet today, it's really just come to mean man I don't agree with. When literal attractive male celebrities are being called incels. Am I oh my gosh, really? The guy from The Witcher? I, uh, I don't think he has problems getting women. Attractive male celebrities are being called incels. It might be time to pack it up. But I'm calling this video incel pickup lines because that is the Twitter account I got. Some oh, I see. Okay, makes sense. Got it green caps from so it's really not that deep <laughs> so without further ado oh god she's crunching again she's so crunchy she did it on her head she cracked her fingers on her head ah howdy she's so Pokes crunchy with boner. how are you beautiful good starts getting hot and takes off my shirt and sh why the furry picture bro the furry picture shape shifts into this <laughs> Okay, you know, as a white woman, 7 out of 10. Sorry for the pick before, that was pretty disrespectful. I was being horny and inconsiderate. I have my own demons to face. Really? A dick pick apologist? I have never had one of those. Honestly, I give it a high rating. I don't think I've ever had a dick apology from my DMs. And be like, I'm fighting demons, and the demons is having a boner. <laughs> you remind me of Eva Braun. What the f I like it. That is a terrible thing to say. Is it? She was hot. I could be the Adolf to your Eva. Nine what in the- 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. I'm pretty good looking and you're not too- What? Who is Eva? <laughs> oh, Eva's his wife? I could be the Adolf to your Eva. That is wild. That is wild. Why was that a 9 out of 10? <laughs> Nine out of ten. Oh, 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 oh. I thought, okay, I get it. I get it. It's nine. I'm pretty good looking and you're not too bad. What's up? LOL, I'll pass. Your loss. FYI, my friends call me horse Clayton. What? The bros? The bros give you that, that nickname? I see. What's up, my sexy slave? Whoa, whoa. That's a first message? Woo! Just kidding, just kidding. I am not a murderer. <laughs> Why is the follow-up with I'm not a murderer even scarier than the message that was first about being a slave? Why is the follow-up somehow even more threatening? Farts very loudly. <laughs> Did you just fart? Because you blew me away. What's- Oh no. Up, sexy baby. <laughs> okay, there is nothing weird about calling like your partner, like you know, your girlfriend or boyfriend baby. But why does sexy baby <laughs> sound so fing weird? Ten sexy and baby together really, really was just not just not it. It just was not it. Ten for the did you just fart you blew me away part though. Wish your toes were in my mouth right now. I mean, hey. Come to Turkey, meet with me. Turkey supports Russia. What? I'm from Ukraine. Turkey supports Ukraine. I'm playing both sides so that I always come out on top. Hey, hey, how oh are my you? God. Good, how about yourself? Pretty good too, thanks for asking. No problem, lol. Have you ever put your feet in someone's face just to mess with them? Lol, just asking cause I'm bored. There's no so many feet fetishes in these DMs. Oh, that's gross to be honest. LOL, that would be funny though. Nah, man. Okay, whatever, bitch. I swear to God, foot fags are so bold online. I cannot think of any other fetish where they actively try to get like strangers to participate in it. Yeah. I'm gonna get you pregnant. The foot fetishes from what I have experienced from random DMs are like the most pathetic. I have never seen like a, a worse group. Daydreaming about how fine you'd be. <laughs> so fine, so, so fine. See? Okay, I guess I spoke too soon about the foot fetish thing because this just reminded me that someone literally did this to me, but as a blueberry. This motherfucker oh, had no. a blueberry inflation fetish straight out of Willy Wonka and- <laughs> This is new to her, huh? This is new. I see. I learned about this from a VTuber called Bao. Anyway. Would send me photoshops of myself photoshopped as a blueberry like i don't want to kink shame <laughs> yes i do what the f is this sir wow <laughs> you are quirky and random and xd what's up ugly b 
bitch. Have you ever been so down bad you XD'd at a woman? Greeting. It's so funny that this would normally be like, oh my god, what is this? What is this blueberry enlarged? What does it mean? But the fact that I've watched, the fact that I've watched bow memes doesn't even make me bad an eye. Things female. <laughs> I am beginning. Yeah, the cursed blueberry song has already gotten me accustomed to what this is. <laughs> my mating <laughs> ritual now you will fall in love with me you will marry me you will bear my children want to hook up no thank you i'm a lesbian oh wait hold on let me go back to that one you know it's bad when it starts with greetings female it, it can only go down from there you will fall in love with me. You will marry me. You will bear my children. Wanna hook up? No thank you. I'm a lesbian. I'm pretty feminine. Lol. Oh god, this one hurt. Hey, the fact that he was still trying after she wrote off his entire gender was impressive. Hey woo. Hello? M may I be able to, to, to oh, go not out these. with you? Not the text stuttering RP, please no. Where are you, woo? Go die. Yo, woman, <laughs> let's f straight to the chase, waste no time. He's not there to play games. 10 out of 10. Do you want to play 21 questions? At least you knew what he was in for. Yes, you go first. You're p uh, describe it. These men are going to turn me into a radical feminist. I that was the worst. He had her interest. She was willing to play the game. Swear to God. You sexy as f for a schizophrenic. Wow. Wow. So you gave her a compliment and also absolutely roasted her in one in one sentence. Why on earth would you say schizophrenic? Oh my bad, I don't know what agender means. And I thought it was because you said they them that you thought you were more than one person. Good thing he apologized and made it very apparent that he's extremely stupid. My bad, I don't understand all the terminology. I just got out of a six-year relationship. I'm new to this. Bro, is she even responding in between, or is this just lined up back-to-back, -back, them talking to themselves, trying to trying to dig themselves out of the hole that they just made? Woof. Woof! Okay, look, he's trying, okay? Honestly, I, I get it. Especially if you've been out of the dating scene for six years. Like, every day I wake up and there's new terminology. Every week I am canceled for being two weeks behind the approved words. What if I showed you my privates right now? Would you show- I w Oh my god. Then you'd be like every guy on the internet in girls' DMs. Please. Show me yours? No. Why, mommy? You're obviously ovulating. I ew! Ew! The BP. So we both benefit. What is a BP? Mmm, boy pussy. Wanna see it? You mean your ass? Kinda. Oh no. But it's oh no. And Kim Kardashian one, don't worry. What? Please, for the love of God, do not- I do not know what is happening in those cursed DMs. Call your ass a boy pussy? You do not have a bussy. You have an ass It took me a minute to understand what he was even saying. You are a grown-ass man. I swear, next time I hear the word bussy, I am pushing the forbidden button that kills one of my subscribers. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, it was nice knowing him. <laughs> Rest in peace to whoever that guy was. My dad hits himself sometimes and throws things because he's depressed that mommy died. I'm scared. Can you be my new mommy? Please Holy crap, we love the trauma dump arc within the, uh, Riz. Come to our house and be my new mommy. You'll love my dad and he will love you, I promise. <laughs> we got the mommy. We got the psychotic manipulation tactics. We got nearly everything in this one. It's Not an entire cesspool to dive in. 9 out of 10. Heh, <laughs> you're nice. How old are you? Oh boy. <sighs> 34. Oh god, no. Please, don't be upset. Do you want to date me? Not the no. RP. Fine, I'll wait a hundred years if I have to. I'll be dead by then. Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> Prize open your casket. You don't look too bad. Man, the riz about the prying open your casket. I was gonna say it's an untapped market, but I, I realized that I would be dipping into a forbidden uh I don't I don't wanna go any further. I don't mean to be rude, and I certainly don't want to be creepy, but are amazing. I don't mean to be out of line, but would it be okay if I have a feel? Looks If I have a feel! My feet shyly and then at you. You're pretty smart for a girl, you know that, right? 
blushes. Um, I'm pretty sure other girls are smart. Eyes widen for a bit of surprise. Thanks to myself. Oh, the oh, RP no. oh, just hurts! Didn't like that. Well, well, it's just biology that men are smarter. We have higher IQs on average. Like, my IQ is 159. Anyway, let's move on. Smiles cheerfully. Hello? Who's- <sighs> Vomits shyly into my mouth reading these DMs. Ooh, ooh. Who's this? Blushes deeply. Uh, oh. God, I wasn't expecting that right off the bat. I'm Vincent from third period. My acquaintance gave me your kick. Oh God. Okay. Looks at the ground and takes a deep breath. <sighs> so what are your plans for this weekend? Can you like not? What is it that you mean? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> a bulge grows larger in pants to signify confidence. Why are we making the pee pee an emoji? I don't know. Excuse me, just passing through gropes you. Oh, I'm sorry, my hand slipped. Looks down in shame. Why- Oh my god, the average anime enjoyer who has not met a woman. Oops, I accidentally fell grabbing your hongi bedoingas. Because that's the average way to fall down when a woman is in front of you. Why do they talk like they are in an RPG? They act like they're yep. playing D&D. &D. I would just start like role playing back and getting like increasingly weirder with it. Teleports behind you. Ooh, <laughs> I blush as I slowly unzip my dick. Oh dear, he thought. Oh, that sounds painful, actually. We might have to get medical help, I say, looking at her frantically and her pee-pee she somehow unzipped. Someone swiped me in the wrong direction again, and I'm trying to <laughs> write an original opening line just to be ignored and left unanswered. Right out the gate with the zero confidence, zero riz. This is like yep. somehow more unattractive than the weird anime furry LARPing. You yes, will not get a pity. Somehow worse. I feel silly asking you this, but you probably get hit up by like 50 guys a day. I know you're out of my league and there's no shot you'll ever respond to this, but oh, I just God. wanted to say, this is so stupid. You're probably showing this to all your friends right now and laughing. My God, I'm just not cut out for this. Sigh. How is your day going? Jesus oh. Christ, dude. Do you want a girlfriend or a therapist? Oh my God, stop doing this. This is pathetic. Women like confidence. Chances are she does have a bunch of guys in her DMs all the time, so you need to like stand out. Being like, how's your day going is not really going to get an answer. Yeah, like, guy just admitted to giving up before he even tried. If I was single and a random guy was like, how's your day going? I would probably ignore it because like, I don't know who you are. I don't like small talk. <laughs> Chances are my day is going fine and it is probably boring because I spent 10 hours hunched over my laptop. Like, I don't know, if she's a gamer, ask her- Average if, content creator life. If she's played some new video game or something. But more importantly, stop doing this ooh woo, I'm so pathetic, I hate myself shit. Yes, See please stop doing the I'm so sorry for myself. It also just makes it about you. Like, it's all about you whining and complaining. Nobody wants to deal with that. Please, do you play League of Legends? Please say yes, or I will literally jump off bridge. When what I in the what in the world is this Riz? Is this a threat? Like what is happening? I said, ask if they play video. This is not how. Oh God, they're doomed. Hello, I am on the top of 100th floor story building, and I have one foot over the edge. I am going to jump in 10 seconds. Only you can save me. Answer me now. Will you have sex with me? <laughs> I really love the ultimatum because he has to have an answer now, yesterday. See you at the bottom, have a good time. These are the most insane ones. These like manipulative histrionic ones. Yes. If you don't answer now, I will die. I'm not Chinese. It's like random chatters on Twitch, man. They'll like enter the chat with like their starting RP that's like three sentences or more long that has nothing to do with the conversation but I can definitely cook some ramen while we watch a movie. That's definitely a way to start a conversation with someone that's Chinese. Who's your what? favorite communist? You look Asian. Oh yeah, cause I am. I mean, these are definitely, uh, I guess at least he didn't ask you, you know, how's the weather? Squid game? <laughs> no, 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 no. I am no longer racist, thank you. Whoa. Shout out to hot black women. Finishing what MLK started. Hello, Jesus. my Nubian goddess. Yeah, no thanks. But you're my darky Ew, waifu. Bro. I bet you so much money that this is like some far right racist Nazi type of guy. Never ask a white nationalist what race his girlfriend is. Man, I don't. 
I told you guys, I don't- I, I'm not somebody who is, like, political. This guy's just a creep, alright? You don't need to know anything about him other than that he's a creep, and absolutely no thanks. Can I be honest? I'm used to the boring, plain Jane white girls. I don't know your ethnicity, but you are one hot brown animal. Did you just call me an animal? A hot yeah. one. <laughs> Where wow, wow. You're from. Don't be all sensitive. I voted for Obama. <laughs> I'm- This is mental illness. I'm a Democrat. You can f me. LOL, sorry, too strong? May I, a woman respecting and feminist supportive male, see at least one breast from you, my queen? Wow, wow, he's asking for boob pics, but he's asking in like a debonair, like, tips hat, may I at least see one breast? One singular serving of titty for me, please, on the table by 9 p.m., if you would, m'lady. <laughs> I was at a party, like, three years ago, and some guy was talking to me about, like, what I do for work, and I was like, oh, I'm a YouTuber, and he was like, what do you talk about? And I'm like, well, like, feminism and, like, current events. And then he just starts going off about how much of a feminist he is and, like, name drops all these, like, feminist authors. And then I was just like, well, I mainly critique modern feminism, and then he just like completely switched up and was like, oh yeah, feminism sucks. It can get really toxic. You pee today? Why don't you want me? You're what are your opinions? My opinions are the same. Ugh. My light, my love, and my reason for being. I could never be with anyone else because any other love would only be a cheap oh, imitation of my feelings for you. You're my Please, one and only. Prince Charming, you're coming off too strong. If you can catch a breath between chugging <laughs> I'd love to hear from you. <laughs> Do me a favor and keep your- That's the other thing is they get so butthurt if you don't respond, they immediately like turn the other cheek and- Clothes on, please. Oh. Okay, excuse me. I don't want to see a girl naked for the first time yet, sorry. I'd rather have a girl who will let me treat her like a beautiful princess every what day. In the Why world? would you ever see me naked? I'm saying I'm hoping not to. Ah oh, yes, the- Don't hurt his virgin eyes. It has to be perfect. He cannot see anything but the perfect circumstances. The reverse psychology method. I do not want to see you naked. I'm not like other guys. Six out of ten. I know what you're thinking. Oh geez, another random internet male beta orbiter sent me a friend request. As soon as I accept it, he'll stalk me, message me, and comment on all my posts with stupid little hearts and smileys. I Bro, you are talking to yourself. I, however, am completely different. Oh no, not the I'm different. Not the I'm different. Hey there, guess you could say I've got edgy humor. <laughs> Have you ever seen American Psycho or Fight Club? Yeah, so that's that's immediately a red flag. Sorry, my mate took my phone. <laughs> Can I stick it in your arm? Sorry, that- What? Sticking a phone in your- What? That was my friend using my phone. Hi. Sorry about that, my friend had my phone. He was saying some crazy things. Anyway, can I stick my entire phone in your bottle? Like- I'm worse. I yeah, I was gonna say. Can you give the phone back to your friend, my dude? Please disregard everything I have said and done from 2014 to last Thursday. That was my friend using my phone. Especially the whole Pokemon smash or pass thing. That was my friend using my phone. Moving on. Have you ever had an abortion? <laughs> yeah. Well, that was bold. Well, have you? Um, no. What in the world? Do you want one? Is this- is this going somewhere? Do you want one? On a scale of 1 to 10, you're Whoa. enough, and I'm the one you need. Cringe. No, Megan. Yeah. You know what's cringe? <laughs> Alright, love. What's cringe is the fact that you probably moan on Twitter Here about- Here we go, as soon as they get rejected. As soon as they get rejected or no response, they go on a villain arc immediately, within like five minutes of their first message. Lads being a piece of sh and yet, when sent a charming and quite frankly smooth message, you turn your back and insult me. With that, Megan, I bid you a good evening and hope that one day- Dishonor on you! Dishonor on your family! Dishonor on your next- Person of kin to burn her under the fire! She's a witch! You find someone who is just as obnoxious as you. Try my best and have it thrown in my face. Gobsmack! Not the gobsmack! This was so f***ing British. I'll tell you what's cringe. Alright, love. You know not to <laughs> about lads. Gobsmacked. Wanna call? FaceTime. No thank you. Right now or else. No what thank is you. Your dad should have pulled out. N-word. Strawberry milk isn't gross. I also like it. It's just I don't really like milk. Yeah, cow milk is not very good. Okay. I just need your milk for my strawberry milk to taste better. All I right, all right. I knew that was where it was going. As a cow VTuber, I could tell. All right. I have seen some wild DMs. The second that the milk was mentioned, I was like, oh boy. Here comes the milk factory owner and it's gonna be... 
a time. I was joking. I'm sorry. Oh my god, she was literally having a conversation with him. And he blew it. I need your milk? Bro. This is so tragic because, like, he already got past level one. Yeah, like he was talking to her and then he was like, wow, I got two messages in. So this must be my opportunity to be creepy. She was already having a conversation with him and he blew it. Most guys in this video aren't even passing where he was. Yeah. <laughs> and he fumbled the bag. Hate to see it. Z Huge L. Zero out of ten. Peas on you. Return the favor. Oh my god. Haha. <laughs> How you been? I would date. I like how afterwards it's just like, so anyways, how, how's it going? Funny weather we're having. <laughs> you, if you were more low-key on social media. My type of girl is more of a low-key girl, kinda insecure, so she feels dependent on me. Hot, but doesn't really know it, etc. Okay, so first of all, pretty weird. Pretty abusive. Bro, are you trying to, like, order, like, this is not build a workshop. You're sending a message to her, and you're like, alright, so, uh... I'm looking for a girl, she's got this, that, and this other thing, and she's relying on me. It's like, sir, this is a Wendy's. <laughs> Second of all, we should hook this guy up with all the insecure guys from the beginning. They're a perfect match. And third of all, isn't this a One Direction song? <laughs> boy, oh. boy, 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 boy. This is weird because I used oh, to babysit no. you when you were little and you were such a brat, but you seem really mature. That is disgusting. That is so gross. Chill now, so I was wondering if you wanted to hook up. No, dude. Stuck up, bitch. I could have had my way with you back then and didn't. Wow, I wow. I don't even know what to say to this one. I'm just gonna hope it's fake and move on. Yeah, that's true. It might be fake, but oof. That's, you got a that's boyfriend? Nasty. Yeah. How big in inches? What? His c you dodged a bullet there, that's all I gotta say. How big? Yo, what's good? I'm gay, but you can change that. Pus what? 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 So good, call it conversion therapy. Oh, no. So I got these ones. It doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. From a place I know where only the smartest, smoothest ladies men reside. Oh god, where? Reddit.com. Oh yeah, I yeah, 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 never mind. These are, these are the pinnacle of... Optimal men. We can tell by the 48 up dudes. These are masters at their craft. I'd like to have sex with you if you know what I mean. I mean, yeah, what? What do you mean if you know what you mean? Heard you like bad boys. Well, I'm a terrible boy. Oh, you like bad? I'm freaking awful. I am garbage incarnate. I'm a woman. We would be Gouda together. It's Gouda! Zero ten. Too cheesy. I want to beat up that pussy like it's black and I'm a cop. I- Excuse me? I've got a knife and a penis. One of them is going in you tonight. Roses are red- What in the threat? Why is- Why are so many of these veiled threats? Or like self-reports? I can't. Violets are blue. We're having sex because I'm stronger than you. Hey girl, are you Whoa. at American school? Because I'd like to sh some kids inside you. At this point, I think they're trying to troll. This is definitely bait. <laughs> I hate that it's good. I hate that it's good. Do not do this, but that's good. Even though I'm not- They know. They know what they're doing. Gothic. You still want to come back to my place and watch some porn on my 65-inch flat screen mirror? I find that offer repulsive. Oh, that's okay. I All right. was gonna say, I think the Reddit ones were 110% sarcastic. It just meant to, to bait people into reading them and thinking they're real. Wait, the bar is in hell because I actually caught myself being like, oh, that's respectful. Like, at least he didn't harass her or tell her to go die. I want you to finger fuck yourself and moan my name. Oh. Kyle. My grandma died. Just come over, baby. I'm sure you will feel better when you're squarting and squelching. What in the squarting and squelch? What in the world? I'm not a juice box. Pusty <laughs> juice. On my heart, man. <laughs> Dude, you it's the new Capri Sun ad. You are so cute. I want to create a Build-A-Bear plushie of you and cuddle you to the sleep. The new Welch's grape juice ad is fire. Sleep every night kisses your forehead. Well, that's creepy, but in totally unrelated news, yeah. there's a new shoe on head plushie. Limited Bro, edition got Hell plush. World shoe plushie. And when you squeeze her, she says slurs. <laughs> no, it doesn't, but... That would be funny. That would be anyway, very link edgy. in the description. Jar not included. I've this is not this is a year ago. It's kind of funny how I feel like this aged a little bit. I well maybe I'm wrong. I feel like she's just a little less edgy now. 
been meaning to tell you something, something I don't think I can hold on to any longer. If you don't feel the same, that's completely fine by me, but I need to tell you I really like you. And I think I'm in love with you. Just stop oh texting me if you feel uncomfortable. I know we've only known each other since a couple weeks ago, but I think we've gotten on really well and started to have a connection. Wait, this isn't even cringe or bad at all. This is just pretty normal and sad. A lot of- I feel like it's not good that it's a confession that's on Discord. This is something you could- you should say to someone. Of these are kind of sad actually when you think about them yeah the biggest the biggest fail here though is the fact that this is a message this is something they sent over a text there's been so much data lately coming out about how lonely men are nowadays it just keeps increasing year after year i mean yeah it's like a normal level of sadness and not a level of like self-reporting mental delulu Asking women for pictures of their feet and telling them that you'll jump off of a building if they don't go on a date with you. Yeah, is see, those are all the Lulu messages, all right? We don't take those seriously. Not going to solve this, but this is pretty concerning and it's something to look into. Maybe, just maybe, I'll look into it for a future video. The male loneliness epidemic. But for now, I hope you enjoyed this little fun video. And uh, give me your best incel pickup line in the comments. Maybe I'll read them in a future video. Bye! That was a good one. That one was pretty hilarious. It was good. Let's go. What do you guys think? You could come up with something better, you know? Like, so have you ever been to a, a hot dog stand? Cause do I got a wiener a sausage with your name on it? Just trying to fit in Two with out the of Mua, 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 mua. <laughs>